Carl came in this morning and he said he was soaking wet because obviously it's miserable out. And actually, if you're thinking of leaving the house today and thus missing the show, do not leave because it's miserable out. It's, it's like a weather report as well. We play music, we've got chat, we have little jokes, don't we? But Carl um, came and, and it's raining. He said he was soaking wet. Yeah. I said to him, I said, Rick would want you to do it. I want yeah. you to do it. Yeah. Just take your clothes off. Pop yeah. them over there. But do you know what? And he wouldn't. And he said I was going to do it, but I knew you'd say that. But w when you left us in the kitchen when he was making coffee, he went. Yeah, Steve said, if you're wet, take your trousers off. And I thought, hold on, Ricky's not here, what's he up to? Little <laughs> <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> thoughts. No, yeah. I was talking on behalf of Rick. I phoned him up, I said, he he's wet, what shall I suggest? Well, I said, well, I, I, I was in his ear, I was, he had an earpiece and I was going, tell him it's bad for him. Yeah. And I could hear him go, it's bad for you, you go, well, no, I'm right. go, no, tell him it's, it could- Rheumatism. Yeah. It could lead to rheumatism, drop, take him off. <laughs> <laughs> Carl, <laughs> Carl, speak, no one's heard your voice today. Come on, Carl. Come he on, doesn't want to. No, I know he doesn't. We're not- we won't talk to you much, All but- right. Go on. It's just nice to say hello to you. Yeah. Right. People- right. I think people quite like they tune to in know you're here. You. Yeah. We've had some fan mail for I you. like his little face, his no. little Moby. I drew a picture of him in the week, just doodling, and he got really insulted. Did he? Why did you get insulted? Because it wasn't very good. I looked like Ian Canfield, or like. <laughs> oh, that's an insult. Yeah, ladies love Canfield. Yeah, I mean they're weird kind of heavy metal ladies. Yeah, but yeah. the, the ones that drink blood. Yeah, yeah, they love Canfield. I thought of you look like today, but I think you might find it insulting as well. It's just meant to be affectionate. You, look, for people who don't know what you look like, you look like Beaker at the Muppets. <laughs> <laughs> I can't see how that would be an insult. <laughs> Ah! Oh God! We don't need to put it like that. It is, but it's sort of like I like Beaker. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But you like him because he's a fool. <laughs> he just goes. M what did he do? <laughs> yeah, yeah. Well, you look a bit like that doctor that used to accompany him everywhere. That professor. Oh yeah, the little he's fat like, little bloke. One, yeah. yeah, that's nice. Carl, yeah. what was it that you told me as well when you came in? Just, just Carl's thought for the day. Okay. Carl, what did you tell me when you came in? Because it was miserable out, and you and you so made it. Suggestion. It is a grim day in London. Um, <laughs> I like it already. I was, I was thinking, um, oh. could you imagine dying today? <laughs> Go on, can you explain more though. Just because when you're dying, yeah. you're always like in your bedroom, in your bed, and your always and your family's next door. Always, yeah. And um, I just thought, can you imagine lying there, looking out your window? Because they do that as well. They sort of have the curtains open to get a bit of light on your face. And I just thought. What a day. If this was like your last day, could you imagine? You said if instead of dying on a rainy day, you'd prefer to... No, if you died on a, on a bit of a, a nicer sunny day, then it's not so bad. What <coughs> I'm saying, no, it's your last day looking out on the world. Yeah. And it, look at it. Don't you agree? Yeah. I, oh, I thought that was a beautiful point. It was poetic, almost. It was, wasn't it? Because no, no, the point was that, that what, what upset me was that you said you'd been thinking about that today on the way in, and it upset you. But uh, my point was that there's, if you think about the people that are dying any day, it'll upset you. Yeah. Do you see? Yeah, but you don't think about it when when it's sunny because you think, well, they'll be all right today. They won't be that annoyed. But You're absolutely annoyed. Right. Annoyed. But to yeah. think of that. Oh, I'm written. No. Oh, God, I'm dying, dying today. Oh, it, was no. just, it was just when I got up and opened the curtains and I thought, look at it. I'm yeah. glad I'm not dying today. Mm. Yeah. 